man, uh, I'm excited, you know, to be able to get this opportunity and this privilege. Um, it really is a true honor, um, you know, and I'm, ex I'm excited to, uh, you know, get the ball less than 24 hours. Um, not going to be much sleep tonight. You know, the adrenaline is going to be rushing. Um, you know, I'll make a phone call to my family here shortly and let them know, uh, you know, the exciting news. But I'll be mentally prepared. I'm ready to go. Just be myself. Um, you know, me and my brother Michael had a, had a uh, cool little phone call last night. You know, um, you know, I just got the news a couple hours ago that, you know, I was taking the ball. But, you know, me and my brother, you know, basically just go be a kid again. You know, go be that high school, that high school kid that, you know, is just super excited to play this game. Go have fun with it. You know, let the emotion out and, you know, everything else will take care of itself. But for me, that's the most important part is is to uh, not take a pitch off, be myself out there for as long as I can. And, and uh, you know, we have one of the best offenses in the game. So I know that they're going to give me some runs early and it's going to be a fun one. Absolutely. You know, I think uh, pressure is a privilege. Um, you know, that's a, that's a saying that, you know, I feel like a lot of people say nowadays, um, you know, it really is a privilege, you know, and, and I'm super excited to, uh, you know, lead our team to the first game of, you know, playoffs in 14 years. It's, it's really is a true honor. You know, it's, uh, I don't even know what to say. You know, I'm, I'm speechless, you know, I'm really excited. Uh, you know, but game one, you know, our, our goal is to take one game at a time. You know, the, uh, the magic number is 13 wins, but, you know, you can't get there without winning the first one. So, uh, you know, we know that the chemistry in this clubhouse is, has been awesome all year with all the uh, challenges and, and uh, unique year that it's been for us. But, you know, we said at the beginning of the year, the champagne tastes the same, uh, you know, and that's our goal doing well in this do for you this year? I mean, the season hasn't gone entirely as you expected. It's kind of a really good start, one not so good start. What can having success here do for you? Yeah, you know, um, you know, reflecting on the regular season, you know, like, uh, like I said, last interview, it, it wasn't the way I wanted to end things, um, you know, for me personally, but I have to put that behind me. You know, I have, like I said, we're, we're on to better things now. And, you know, one start doesn't define somebody, but, you know, everybody starts oh oh in the postseason. Everybody's record's the same. Everybody gets a fresh start. Um, so basically, I guess you can call it, you know, this is season, season number two of uh, the 2020 season. So I'm super excited to be able to take the ball, like I said, but, um, you know, I'm going to go out there and dominate. I'm going to go out there and, and pitch with confidence. I'm going to go out there and, and pitch with emotion um you know i know the cardinals are going to be man just like he, he said it like we, we're good but just the fact like we have each other back like me then manny you know we have guys that can turn this game with one swing and obviously we have put great at bats together and that's the thing like we're gonna feed of out of each other so just the the mentality we have is we know we have each other's back, so that's going to be the big point for us. Fernando, thank you. Your, your father obviously is a bit of a legend with the Cardinals. I, I wondered what your relationship was like with the Cardinals when, when you were a kid and he was playing with them and your memories. And then also just what that whole circumstance was like with them scouting you and if you ever expected to be a Cardinal. <laughs> that's, uh, that's, that's a great story. But uh, – you know, there was a great scouting out there. I uh, did a lot of trial for the organization in San Luis, although it didn't happen. Um, they did offer me. That was a great part. And uh, what can I say? We're just over here going kind to of play some great baseball. I have some great memories from the Cardinals, and we're grateful. You know, my dad played for them, and he played a couple of years. But his best, his best season was for the Cardinals. So they obviously have a part in our heart, uh, especially with my dad. and. Uh, but I'm sorry, over here we're gonna we're gonna step on the field. We ain't friends no more. <laughs> what do you recall of their time scouting you? I mean, you you got to know their scouts really well, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we we did spend a lot of time together, and uh, but nothing. I think that that wasn't the path God ha God has God had it for me, and uh, stuff here turned out a way different.